One thing that's really important to remember about security with mobile is people didn't invent it overnight. You can't start a company today and say, I do everything with mobile security for tomorrow. Because all these security problems that people have uh, solved with the web, they all apply to mobile as well. So you need a deep security infrastructure to apply for mobile problems as well. Mobile phones have become such personal devices that some would rather share a toothbrush than a handset. But as our attachment to our cell phones increases, so too do consumer concerns about data privacy and security. Where do mobile apps come from? That is, how do you create them? And again, people are very familiar with what they may look like on the phone or the tablet. But, you know, they connect to something in the back end. And oftentimes, the application infrastructure in the data center is far, far bigger and far more complicated than what you might see on the phone. So both are halves of, of the general problem there. So how do you build it for the different devices? And there are many of them, iPhones, Android, other things as well. How do you do the secure communication to the back end? How do you do all the con connectivity to your applications? They could be ERP systems, CRM systems, custom systems, data. We're seeing malware growing in great proportions. We're seeing the malware growth reach the growth that we saw on PCs uh, about 10, 15 years ago. And so we want to make sure that people know ahead of time, before it happens to them, that they have protection against viruses and malware. But we have something called app protection, which is probably a very, uh, our most robust and new type of uh, security option. And what it does is three things. First of all, it will take an inventory of your installed apps on your phone and give you a graphical depiction of what those permissions are. As a Google developer, we have up to 160 permissions that you can actually integrate into your software. What we'll do is we'll give the ability to kind of let that user know what the app is doing on a device. So for example, if a chess game is accessing your contacts or transmitting that data from your phone to some other entity, we'll let you know that. Our phones are well on their way to becoming far more than just a communication device, with location tagging, data transfer, and even mobile wallet applications coming to the fore. Security is a big concern. A lot of things have been done on top of the encryption codes to make them really secure. But more it's getting the consumers to accept the security, getting the consumers to decide that, hey, I'm going to basically not reach for my wallet, but I'm going to reach for my phone, tap it, and get the payment. And then you've got to have the consumers accept the understanding that if my phone gets lost, all my credit card information is not going to go into the hands of the wrong person. Because the phone is essentially the digital wallet of the future, and all of the consumers have to be accept of the accepting of the fact that if my phone gets lost, my entire life doesn't go away with it. You know, when they talk about putting their credit cards, debit cards, inside a mobile phone, the initial reaction is always, oh my God, why would I do that? It's not so secure. But if you think about it, if you drop your physical wallet, your leather wallet, if you were to drop it here near the stand somewhere, it would be gone very, very quickly and you'd lose all your cash, all your cards, all your identity would be gone in seconds. Well, one of the advantages of having it all in one place on a mobile device is it can be wiped down remotely. So I can call one phone number, have my phone wiped out remotely. I can go back to my carrier. I'm on a buy a similar phone. Please restore all my wallet the way it was. Today I may have to call four or five different banks, deal with the driver's license authority, go to several places to kind of get all this replaced. So there's a possibility for this to be a, a bit more convenient in the element of, uh, of theft or loss.